Helmets at the ready, these pupils are ditching the car and gearing up to get more active on the school run. The big pedal is back for another year, getting thousands of children across the region walking, scooting or cycling to class. In York, around 30 schools have signed up to join the initiative. But here at Stainer Hall Community Primary Academy, it isn't just the parents and the pupils who are getting involved. We, we thought it might be a nice opportunity to lead by example, really, and show the children that we're prepared to do the same. So three of us, uh, myself, Mr Moss and Miss Blythe, this morning have, have got up very early uh, and we've cycled to Selby from York. Um, leaving York this morning just before seven o'clock and arriving at school at half past eight. So it's been a it's been a fresh start to the day, but we've enjoyed it. We're feeling much more alert and awake than we than we usually are at this time. We may be asleep by lunchtime, but for us it's been a, it's been a lovely start to the day. Last year, a staggering 1,179 kilograms of nitrogen oxide was avoided as a result of the 10-day challenge, and almost 46 million calories were burned from participants cycling and scooting to school. But here at Stainer Hall, these aren't the only benefits that the children are noticing. It brings our community together, and it's more safer on the roads. Yeah. There's not many people on the road, so it's safer to cross for the children coming into the school. Some schools may just come on cars and I think that they should get more exercise uh, and then maybe to wake them up a bit before school and get more exercise. It helps them wake up, it gives them more energy and, um, it's, he and it's healthy for them. And a very warm welcome was waiting at the school gates. We've been giving stickers to people coming on their bikes and scooters or walking uh, and it's good for them and it's more exercise. It's good for your brain and your muscles and lots of power on your body. It make, wakes them up more and it gives it, it helps you exercise. The parents play a crucial role in promoting a more active school run. I think ultimately the parents are the ultimate role models for the children. So if the parents really buy into this and see the, the benefits for them as adults, I think the children are more likely to buy into it as well. So I think for some of them it takes a while. Take, you know, We've got to convince that we might want to dust off the bikes that have been in the shed all winter, perhaps been in the shed for many years. But actually when you see the parents coming through the, the gates on their bikes, you see the smiles on their faces as well and actually you don't know what that might lead to perhaps there's a family bike ride at the weekend yeah it makes me feel proud to be head of a school where we've got such uh, such great families and children who are who are actively getting involved in the initiative for this school they are hoping that the effects of the big pedal challenge will continue long after the two weeks are up developing habits of a lifetime for these pupils and their parents abby walker that's tv